You just heartache her out of here. Where is the treasure? <laughs> Where oh dear, oh dear. You didn't really think it would be that easy, did you? Things that are lost are waiting to be found. Okay. But what of those precious items that have been hidden, stashed away for good reason? Should we go looking for treasures we are not supposed to find? You are talking nonsense, Mr. Hardacre. So true. Nonsense, is it? Well, we shall see. Okay. Watch your back, Danville. Not everyone in this town is as accommodating as myself. There are those who won't take too kindly to you digging up what should lay buried. Okay. That's enough questions, Danvers. If you insist on staying, think on what I have said. You're just a lad. Be careful what you go looking for. Good night. Such a master manipulator. Good night, Mr. Hardacre. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. That was really boring. <laughs> he turned into a ghost. He was fucking foreboding lobsters. Very scary. Very tasty. Did the moon move at all? I wasn't really paying attention. Oh, oh god, it didn't move then. Okay. Oh, uh, right. Oh, look how cute that is. It's a little thing. Where are you going? Hmm, what's this? Oh, that's the moth. Alright, what are these? Bottle caps from Chili's. Haddon! Alright, Alex spit more. Mm. I wish he'd spit less. I lie. I like it. A new face arrived in town. Stranger calls themselves Danvers. Over at Danvers booking Hyper Cottage. Danvers entered Hyper Cottage, has yet to leave. What's he up to? Scary! Alright. New face. What's this? What the? Wait, so it's just. Wait a minute. So it's nothing new, it's just. Oh, fuck. Oh, okay, because I thought I crashed the game. Alright, well, that's annoying. Oh! Alex Bitmore has been. Uh, spying on us. That's cool. I like that guy. I want to seduce him on in here. What? What? The, what? It's like, I'm so scared to hang this up. Oh, we're gonna fall. Hello up there. Oh, good evening to you. Hmm. What a kind soul. It's like, would you like me to hold the ladder? What are you doing? Fixing this here bunting to the buildings. Mm. Why? Is there a celebration? <laughs> Why? Where are you being hiding? There's May Day round the corner. For fuck. Oh. Saxton's a quiet town. Well, if you say so. Not with us yelling at, in the middle of the night. Could you fix the electricity at Harbour Cottage? Gone again, is it? Damn wiring. Is that a no? Hey, for now. Sorry, lad. Who are you? Um, bye. I'll let you get on. May Day will come quicker that way. <laughs> yeah, when people stop talking to each other, it seems like the hours go by faster. What is this ugly cat? Gross. Seagull by day, cat by night. Alright. Oh, I can't. Now to find a phone box. Phone hat. Time to make amends. Alright. I'll promise so many sexual favors. <laughs> Only because I'm scared. Not because I want to do those things. Okay. A link to the legend. Hyperlink. Okay, so let's uh, go this way. I went the wrong way. The foreboding music of fucking Jess. There you go. It reeks with fear. I like this music though. Okay, just walking down. Ooh! There's a phone box! <laughs> and the woman. We could be fine for that, you know. Excuse me? Pasting posters? Fly posters? It's illegal, isn't it? Is it? I have no idea. Is there something you want? Are you lost? Actually, I have something of yours. Oh, really? And what's that? <laughs> Pulls Your on his dick. <laughs> Here, take it. You fucking bitch. Take oh, it. Oh, um, thanks. I didn't mean to snap. I'm just, you know. So what's the 
poster for? So, what's the poster for? Take a look. Oh, could I? Hmm. <laughs> look at the guy in the fair. front. Huh. Oh dear. Are the freaks coming to town? You could say that. I'm Nigel, by the way. Nigel Danvers? I'm Lucy. Lucy Rubens. Ooh. Ah. Uh, I see. Smooth. Part of the fair? Yep. I'm one of the freaks. I like a freak. I really do. I didn't mean to offend you. Too late. Aw. It's cool. Uh. I saw you. Out in the, uh, reed beds. All I read was yeah. I saw you in bed. Oh, what the fuck? Fence. What's the origin? It's Anglo-Saxon. For a swamp, or marsh, or bog. Quagmire, perhaps? Quagmire. So do you too. Oh, a comedian. <laughs> I don't even get it. So, are you local? I was, but I only returned for the holidays. You must know the surrounding area very well. Not really. I tend to stay in town. I have my studies. Ah, studies. what are you studying? Psychology. Really? So what do you make of me? You are desperate, insecure, and seeking phantom treasures. Oh. How did you know that? Ah, pretty obvious, is it? Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Uh. I'll leave you to, um, paste your posters. See you around, sunshine. Aw. Sweet. Do to paste my poster. have a room right there with a type right there. Hmm, what's this? I don't let's investigate. Da 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 What is it? Alex Spitmore press pass. Seek the Oh my fucking god dude. Alright. I don't know how I'm gonna edit this. Uh, hello Alex Spitmore press pass. Saxton Times Seek the truth, find the answer. Um, well, sure. I don't know what to say to that. How come? Where's my card? Can I put that on there? Did it work? It did. Ha! Huh. Great. So happy. Look at those hint hinges are printed on there. I want to speak to Haddon. Please. And why would Mr. Haddon? Want to speak to you? Hmm. I have something to say. To make a deal. A deal. My dear, what could you possibly offer? Haddon? Hmm. Speaking. Is there something you want to say? Leave me alone. Hmm. I didn't see anything. So call off your dogs. Ah. Mr. Hare and Mr. Crow are not have your dogs. In mind, Nigel. Well, they won't find me. I've left the city. Yes. How are you finding Saxton so far? That phone box looks a little, uh, old-fashioned. <gasps> what? How did you... Are you still spying on me? Oh, Nigel. That's a little rich, coming from you. A poor boy. I didn't intend to hack your files. Like you didn't intend to print off some copy. What is that stuff, anyway? The future, dear boy. And the past. Mm. We have the technology. As you know. Alright. What if he just. Dan Riz looks to the side and he's like, Lucy! Lucy is Haddon. What do you want from me, Mr. Haddon? Nothing and everything. A few oh, little times. It's always either or. Oh, I'm gonna have to stop recording. This is ridiculous. Help us with our research. You won't go unrewarded. Alright, we'll see you in a second. Right. <sighs> I'm sick of talking to you. Now, now. This time. doesn't look like I can Keep leave. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, we'll finish this conversation. That would be done. I hope we don't have any more interruptions. Where are Hare and Crow? They've lost your scent, Nigel. You need not worry. Mm. Crows don't smell so good. Tell me about the research. Ah, I knew you'd show an interest. You can help us, Nigel. Ah. I'm not a scientist, Haddon, nor a ghost hunter. 
paranormal research can require very little, Nigel. I have nothing except the clothes that I stand Exactly, oh my god. Scrying. I beg your pardon. I beg your fucking Scrying. pardon, you Ancient upstart. <laughs> you only need water and a mirror. What do I do? Is it dangerous? It can be. Pour the water down the mirror and watch. And wait. And wait. You may be surprised by the results. We often are. Hmm. We? You practice this scrying in the lab? Yep. Yes, with amazing results. Just believe and look deeply. The ghost hunters of old showed great ingenuity. Oh. I suppose you would have to be ingenuous. <laughs> uh, uh. How do you know where I am? I know everything about you, Nigel. Ooh. How comforting. <laughs> What happens next? Await my gift. It was dispatched this afternoon. Blah, How did you know where, uh... Where you'd stay? Mm. Like I said. Mm. You know everything. What's the gift? You will see. Mm. Not all is as it seems. Keep that in mind. <laughs> These experiments, am I in any danger? Oh my I... god. No, but, uh... I've always suspected that life should be more interesting, more exciting. I hate my job. Yeah, I'd do anything to get away. This could be your big break, Nigel. I see you as, how can I put this, a little bit of an investment. Aww. <laughs> so, I'm forgiven for snooping. Curiosity and ingenuity should be rewarded. Right. Good night, Mr. Haddon. Good night, Mr. Danvers. Good hunting. Good hunting. Or should I say ghost hunting? <laughs> oh, like finally stop. All right, no one upon in Haddon's game. So Haddon sees me as an investment, eh? Part of a larger experiment? So be it. He wants me to experiment using the paranormal techniques of ages past. Also, that fussy Professor Harding here suggested the cottage is haunted. A good place to start my experiments. Oh, don't know why he wouldn't start there anyway. Scrying, pour water down a mirror and gaze deeply into the diffused the reflections. Conduct a simple seance, see if there's anyone or anything trying to come through. Explore the cottage with an open mind. Does the place have any cold spots? Atmospherics? Who was that old woman? You might be the woman. What? Oh, okay. So, that is that. I gotta go fix my internet. And I, I didn't realize that it would... I didn't realize the pop-ups that were asking me to sign in to internet thingies because the internet keeps going out. And don't ask me, it's just such a dumb setup. Like, But it works for the most part. This rarely happens. But the pop-ups keep fucking me over. It's probably going to happen again in like two seconds. I'm pretty sure it will. Oh, that light went out. Did they go? Did they go to bed? I think they have. All right. Anyway. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode um, of the Lost Crown Ghost Hunter Adventure. We got to talk to. Oh, they're awake again. We got to talk to um, a few new people. So that's cool. Oh, I got to see that cold-hearted fucking freak right there. Um. But yeah. So next time we'll go back to the cottage and see if there's any ghosts there. I think Haddon just told us how to scry so we could look like an idiot, but whatever. I'm gonna sneeze. Uh, okay, well anyway, without further ado, hope everyone's having a great day or night, and remember to stay beautiful. Bye! <laughs>